Hi, I'm Andrew Weddinghouse and better known as ET. And this year, Anaconda has teamed up with the NRL to bring you the fish of origin. We've got two great teams and the lineups here for the Queensland boys, Jonathan Thurston and Stevie Renouf. And for the Blues on this side, we've got Bo Scott and Nathan Hindmarsh representing the Blues team. to Thurston, here they come again, the ball has been knocked out by the tackle of Bo Scott, and it's a knock on against Queensland. Yeah, great defence, he was looking for that cutout pass. There he is, there he is. Yeah! 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 Then the Fittler, the kick, oh, it's a try! Eddinghausen has got the perfect bounce! I'm Andrew Eddinghausen, and for the last 22 years, I've been escaping with you to some of Australia's best fishing locations. For the next three mornings, JT, Pearl, Hindy and Bo Scott will be riding the chopper to board a game boat and compete in three unique fishing competitions. Fish of origin, points will be allocated for each fish boated. I know the boys' super competitive spirit will ensure a tight contest. The great thing about all of this is we've got fantastic gear, best from Anaconda and they have the biggest variety of tackle. Well, this is where the exciting stuff starts for the boys. To catch the big deep water fish like a large mouth nanny guy, you're gonna need a special outfit. Like this Taipan 10 to 20 kilo stick, nice and solid down the bottom, whippy up the top, matched with this Saragossa 14. Absolutely brilliant gear, but you can't just catch the fish with a rod and reel. You're gonna need some terminal tackle. And Anaconda have got the lot. I'm gonna pack some of this 80 pound Nomad Braid onto the Saragossa, then put some Tiagra leader. Now this is 80 pound, we're gonna form a beautiful Pat Noster rig with a heavy sinker on the bottom, which is that guy right there, followed by some mustard hooks. Nice and strong to get some of those beautiful, big crimson, large mouth nanny guy up to the boat. This is the Saragossa with a tie pan rod. Pretty strong stuff, but you're gonna be fishing in about 65 metres of water. And when you're down there, boys, hang on tight. We will. There's a few different things in this game. We've got the power play. So you can nominate 30 minutes, get extra two points every fish you bring in. Grab your weapons, boys. Well, while we're here, we're actually gonna nominate our power play for the next 30 minutes. Okay, we're so on. you guys are on. Right. Power play. How about you boys? Hey. He's gonna run. Hey. A bit of confusion. Hey, what? what's right. happening? What's happening? I don't know. What are you doing? Hey. Are you doing it or not? Yeah, yeah we'll yeah, win. Oh, oh, yeah. oh, all right, all right, okay. So you nominate at the same time. You can, you can, if you like. You can get your own stuff at the same time. All right, okay. We're on. Righto, boys, lines in. I'm sure the last thing the teams want to kick off with is a shark. That detested fish stealing menace all anglers hate. When you hook these things, a long way up. Yeah, it's a long way down. Oh, I think I've respawned. Do you reckon that's the bottom? Skipper Ash has pinpointed a large school of nanny guy on his depth sounder. He'll position the boat to drift over them, and when the school has passed out of range, he'll relocate back to the sounder's mark for another drift. <laughs> just go, watch us go. Wine, 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 a good one. Lift and then wind down. And he sure put the boys on target. Wind down fast. Sort of wind. 
Fine is the first receiver. He's a relatively inexperienced angler, so I'm lending a hand. Going well. Yep, beautiful. Come on, back. It's a red one. Oh, oh yeah! Look at that, baby! Yeah! Well done! <laughs> it's a six-pointer. Well done, six champion. Pointer. Six pointer. Whoa, the blues, they're sneaking ahead. First points on the board thanks to Nathan Hindmarsh. Six nil to the blues. Hindy's on again. Hindy is on fire. He is absolutely, absolutely killing him at the moment. He's landed one beautiful big largemouth nanny and now he's onto a second. He's, uh, he's put his big piece of squid on there. He's let the fish take it. He's hooked him up. Tell you what, he's doing well. Number 11, Hindmarsh. Woo! Oh, you got yeah, some Yeah, come on. All right. Thurston's coming good. Come on, JT. Oh, nice. Let's bring him out that time. Unfortunately, Hindy has snagged JT's line. Maybe it's time for JT to bring out his tackle-busting oh, skills to get yeah, square. That's mine. Oh. <laughs> Look, it's coming to me. <laughs> yeah. Yeah. Oh, the power play. The power play. JT, he's, he's wrapped up your line as well. Yeah. Taking you yeah, out of that. Foul play. Foul play. Surely that's a duck. No, cutting off. Don't cut me off. No, no, cut JT off. Yeah. Hey. Smoking. Another beautiful, yeah. beautiful yeah. Well caught, Heine. Good stuff, champ. That's two up with number 11, Nathan. 12 zip, with Queensland still to threaten the try line or in this instance, the fishing line. Bo Scott is the only experienced angler in the group, but it's hard to keep JT out of the action. Come on, champion, on, JT. <laughs> come on, Baba. All right, come on, this is the one. Shark, where's the sharks when you need it? Has it feel, JT? Feel good? Yeah. This is the Anaconda power play, so the boys have got two drifts worth and double points. Hey, double whammy, got old Stevie on. here on. This could even it up. They both get their fish in. That's I, it. You I got him there, Pearl. No, I've lost him. Hey? I don't think so, mate. Keep him coming. Oh, yeah? Where's the oh. sharks when you need them? Come on, sharks. Where's the sharks? Oh. Where's the sharks? Come on. Not the emperor of Lang Park, Wally Lewis, but a red throat emperor. When a fish that's not the target species is caught, anglers refer to them as bycatch. Oh, it's a big one. Here we go. Oh. <laughs> Eight-pointer. <laughs> Eight-pointer right there. That's Jeez. a crack. Wow, well done. Both the Queenslanders have come through. That's your first fish, Pearl. That's my first. Red throat in front. Ah. Look at this, baby. <laughs> Drop it. Drop it. Yeah. <laughs> tinny. It's so tinny. Hey, 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 baby. Baby. It always happens. Ah. This is a raw. Double points finished like five minutes ago. Oh, look at this bad boy. Mwah. Show Pearl's massive thing that he got. Come and grab him, boys. Double points and finish, DT. It's ah. <laughs> an eight pointer. Oh. Eight points and then. Uh, eight pointer. So they've dragged it back with him. Ten points, ten points. Ten points. up here at the moment. <laughs> they just got ten points. Because they got, they got, uh, it's the biggest fish so far. Eight points for this one and two for uh, Stevie's. <laughs> That's a top team effort for the Maroons and it's quickly narrowed the gap. Queenslanders have come back. Yeah, We've got one more drift, one more drift, double points, one more drift. The boat is travelling back for the second drift across the nanny school. And JT? Well, he's, he's just been JT. <laughs> yeah, Tinny man. Adrenaline pumping, Tinny man. The heart's pumping. It, it does help their cause, but we're not, I don't think we're worried. Well, he has wham, wham, wham. One to go, mate, one drift to go here. Wham, wham. Under the table payment to the, to the deckhands here, the blokes bringing their, all their rods and putting their baits on for them and all that type of stuff. He went missing for a while. Oh, Paul, he went missing. He I went out. asleep actually at one point. Well, um... I saw him come back with a fish and I thought it was the one I caught. Oh, and he, he went it outside on, the boat, yeah, lifted it up, and dragged, dragged it around. around. Oh. Yes, yeah, I saw oh, it. Yeah. Get back there, we'll catch a big one. Where are right now? Yeah. I heard you squeal. You squeal. 
So it's minus six pointer. Actually, an eight. It's actually an eight pointer. He got two points. Yeah. And you got eight. The last power play drift. And Hindy points out the bleeding obvious. Two points, it's two points. The end of the day. You don't need a point to win. Hindy's tiny tiddler means that the Blues are pushed out to a tidy lead. This is the last drift of the day, and fishing time is running out. Yeah, drop it down again. Nice. Look at them, look at their faces. Oh, nice one. Woo. Just touch the leader, mate. Thank you. Nice, big ready. Yeah. Nice mounting guy, yeah. Mate, nice work. Beautiful fish. Hey, pretty good. Bragger. The gap has widened to at least three fish. And Bo Scott, with his angling expertise, is running red hot. Wow, come on, Queenslanders. What are you doing? Come on, you need a fish. What do you reckon we're done, are we? <laughs> Hotter than a jalapeno oh, chili. Hey, yeah! Oh, yeah, yeah, oh, yeah! You want JT? Woo! All right, nice fish. Gosh, not before. Oh. Oh. JT. JT's on. Oh, coral trout. trout. That's a two-pointer. That's, that's, two, two that's a two-pointer, two but let, uh, let me say there's also points for uh, high oh. catch. So, uh, mystery oh. points, mystery points. Let's go, poorly boy. Who knows? Let's but... go, poorly boy. But those mystery points only get allocated at the end of the three days. So today's match is still up for grabs. Need on. No. And something huge has grabbed hold of Jonathan's line. Oh yeah, it's a good fish. JT's on. They're gonna come back to Queensland and need this fish desperately. <laughs> Who's gonna win the fish of origin? These maroons at the back or the blues <laughs> on the side? This could be the one. What a comeback, eh? Never say die, Queenslanders. They're back in the hunt. <laughs> Gotta pull them up like me, get into Anaconda. Yeah, brother. <laughs> All the best stuff you need. That rollicking double act has rapidly reduced the margin. It's now only a one fish ball game. The dynamic dueling Shimano's are in full cry. partner will go straight here. It is very close to full time and the fishing leaders have to be touched before the final siren. Yeah. Oh! Yeah. The equivalent of a field goal to nearly even the scores. But even if Stevie's is a bycatch, that will be enough, so long as it's in before the siren. It's now up to the pearl. Like that famous try with Mark Coyne, the Maroons are surging towards the line. But a tangle with JT when the line is wide open is definitely not what the Maroons need. No, I'm done, I'm done, I'm out. Yeah. Did not like the feel of that. Go on, you thing. It's a cobia. <laughs> it's all happening. They got cobia swimming on the top, a shark on this side. Oh my God, it's all happening. Well done. Cobia, woohoo! Pearl jagged a cracker of a cobia, and because they fight harder than a cornered croc, it just had to take out the unique catch bonus. Yeah, all right, all right. Woo. Queensland have done it That's again, good, pulled the game from out of nowhere. That's a good one, Stevie. Good stuff, mate. Well done. And JT is very, very happy. Two, I've got the two on the one, yeah, two, two on the one. <laughs> Took me about 20 minutes to get it up. Brought you back into the, the competition, oh, yes, we're gone. Oh, we were, we were. The Queensland spirit comes to the fore. <laughs> so I might have said it a few times before we actually started fishing, that 
He's a tin man. Like he, he'll, he'll pull something out of his backside and he'll end up getting the victory somewhere, somehow. And the Pearl got some mysteries he too. Did. Pearl, he got a nice big cobia. Great experience and um, very, uh, very grateful to Anaconda and, and to Shimano. It's, some of the gear we've been fishing with has been just top notch. So the Queenslanders take out the opening game of the series. The boys are flying off, but they'll be back for game two. Tune in to follow your state team to see who wins this year's Fish of Origin. <laughs>